Closure of Noah's event venue in Selma continues to impact those who use that space. Now members of a church say they're left without a place to worship. Livingstone Church had used the space for almost five years, but now they're searching for a new home. The night team Stephen Cavazos now with how they plan to move forward. What? It's like our church, the place where we go every single week. We can't go there anymore. Members of the Livingstone Church left in disbelief and without a place to worship after the venue they used for service filed for bankruptcy. Somebody had posted something on Facebook and I saw it and I was like, whoa, this can't be real. The church now searching for a place to gather. Tonight, that was at Revolution Church after Noah's event venue closed all their locations across the country, something that left thousands frustrated and demanding answers. There was an, an initial like, oh, that's kind of, oh, what are we going to do? But we are honored to get to come together however, wherever, God, with your people as one. But these members say they're leaning on their faith in an uncertain future. We know really that God is going to to provide our next home, our next location. Senior Pastor Landon Kiker says that's already in the works. Kiker hoping to find a permanent home for the congregation. And with the venue closing, he says the timing is just right. Now that this has happened, they're like, well, we were already looking ahead to the future anyhow. Despite losing their space, Kiker says members of the church have stayed optimistic. Uh, the church, I don't think I've ever seen our church more unified than it is now. And he says that's the purpose of why they come together. We don't exist to build buildings, we exist to build people. Stephen Cavazos, KSAT 12 News.